Welcome back to the vlog. I think we are gonna actually have to extend staying here one more night than we planned. But it's actually um, like later in the morning. I woke up at 4.30 and I've been waking up at 4.30 while we've been staying here. I think because of like stress and also like obviously not drinking enough water. But it, like it just is what it is. It's not permanent obviously. I don't have any plans um, other than the Yankee game tonight. Rob and I are gonna go meet two of our friends um in the bronx at yankee stadium they're playing at like 7 p.m i think is the game time i do want to go see kaya because i've been trying to go to my mom's house every day like i just miss her and i hate not being with her so i think i'm gonna get dressed get some coffee get some breakfast and then head over there and grab her you guys <laughs> these pants used to be so long and Rob was so sweet and he like went to the house and did some laundry for us, but he put these in the dryer. <laughs> and now I need to like spend a few minutes like stretching them out. They will stretch their cashmere pants, but <laughs> like no, 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 no. Are you perfecting your like squat over there? I don't have I my problem is that I don't I don't put enough on my heels. So that's when I every and then when you let all the oxygen out of your body, you could go solid inch farther in any stretch you do. Good morning. Um, it's late in the morning. It's like 10.30. Rob had to run to our apartment this morning because he had to meet some of the workers there, but the unfortunate news is that our drywall didn't dry, and so they can't start painting until Monday. So we only have our hotel till tomorrow as of right now so i don't know we're gonna have to figure that out yeah when rob gets back i'm gonna figure out a game plan with him basically and go from there so uh he's coming back with breakfast and coffee yeah the yankees lost last night i was so sad but the padres are like uh they're a really really good team so um it was a really really good game last night was so fun i'm excited to go to some more games this season and we didn't get home too late honestly we did pretty good but i showed you guys last night rob was like i drove home because <laughs> i had one drink i had one beer <laughs> he just comes back to the hotel room and he's like stretching and like i don't know rambling about something <laughs> i don't yeah, we just had a really good time last night, so I am going to 
Do some shopping. All right, this is my outfit for today. I have on these Zara parachute pants. And I have these in black too. I like really, really like them. And I think the pockets are cute. My Veja sneakers. And then this cropped tank is from Aritzia. And then this is uh, very old, but it's a free people dress that I just wear as like a over shirt usually. And yeah, we're gonna go stop by and see Kaya before we head upstate. So I'm excited to go see my baby. It is 80 degrees today. Summer's coming. <laughs> I'm ready for it. We just stopped by the apartment. Rob's picking up some wine real quick because the friends we're going to see tonight, they like exchange um, their olive oil that they get from Greece. It's made in Greece from like Greek olives. And they give us olive oil and we give them homemade wine. So it's really nice. The olive oil is, I think I mentioned this, but I've not been sleeping well. So I'm really tired, I'm really dehydrated and I just really need to get back into a better schedule and back to like working out and moving my body because I haven't really done that much lately. I also really need to get my hair cut really badly. It's like a little too long. I like it to like kind of cut off here usually, but my hair lady is booked through August 30th. She just went back to the salon and she's already booked through the end of the summer. <laughs> Mountain Valley water. Do you know best. the name of the olive oil that they give you? It's their own. I'm saying you don't know the brand. They press it. It's homemade pressed Greek from Greece olive oil. But they don't have a brand name. They put a brand name out. I don't even know what it's called, but it's like literally. They sell it out of their restaurant. But nowhere else. Uh no, they don't have it on shelves in like supermarkets or anything. But uh. Yeah, it's one of the best olive oils I've had, though. Mmm. <laughs> Mike, doesn't like a good, good, fresh Italian sandwich. A plus. We're heading over to the outdoor movie now. We just stopped in town in New Paltz. There's a really cute little market area called Water Street Market. And we absolutely love it here. It's just so cute and clean. And there's so many different types of people. And I don't know, I just, we love coming up here. But I wanted to show you guys what I got. Rob got some stuff too, but um, I got this cute little stuffed animal and the woman was on the street and she was knitting them by hand and I just really wanted to support her and I thought that this was just so cute. I really love it and I just think it's so special that someone like hand knit this so. If you're wondering what kind of stores are here there's a little bit of everything. They have a dog store or a pet store I should say. They have things for cats in there too if you have a cat. And they have a little ice cream shop. They have some restaurants. They have like a little bohemian store that's mostly jewelry, but they do have like bags and clothes in there as well. And um, yeah, there's just so many cute little shops around.
That is mine. You can tell by the color. Color. All right, we just went to Martinez. It's right there. And I got a latte, and Rob just got like a cold brew with espresso. Not that he needs it, because he definitely doesn't. But, you know, that's what's happening. Gives um, you a little edge, you know? And then I got a blueberry muffin for breakfast. I'm like really hungry this morning, but I have a blueberry muffin. It looks really good. I already started eating it. But we're heading to Hester Street Fair. It's um, in South Street Seaport in the city. I'm moving our bum, so we're gonna go check it out. Yep. Perfect. And I'm gonna eat this in the car. ordered some Greek food. I got a salad and some shrimp on the side. And then there's also some pita bread and um, tzatziki sauce. So I'm going to eat this for dinner, but I think Rob and I are just going to chill. I don't know if we're going to try to watch like a movie or something, but we're both definitely trying to get to bed a little bit early because neither one of us have slept very much in the last week. So and tomorrow is Memorial Day, but I have to go to work and Rob also has to go to work. So we're not really getting a three day weekend. <laughs> so that's what's going on. But yeah, I'm gonna eat this because it looks so good. Don't stop. <laughs> so rude. Oh, I look rough. Um, I'm very tired. You can, I feel like you can tell this whole vlog, like I'm just tired. <laughs> There's really no getting around that. We're pretty defeated. Um, I'm just editing this vlog right now and I wanted to end it off. We had a really fun weekend. Like you guys saw, we saw the Yankee game. We went upstate to New Paltz and to Poughkeepsie. And we also spent Sunday like in the city, which was really fun. I would highly recommend the Hester Street Fair if you're local. Like I said, it's in South Street Seaport. And we decided to take the boat across to Red Hook and have lobster rolls, which I also highly recommend that place. The only thing is there's not a whole lot to do in Red Hook. So if you want to go for more than that, I would walk over to like, uh, I think it's called like Fulton Street. But yeah, you can walk over to like Dumbo and do some shopping over there. The stores are a little pricey. Like we walked over there to get the uh, boat back just because it, Wall Street's the first stop if you walk back over that way. Instead of leaving out of Pier 6 because then you have to like stop a bunch of places before you get back to the city. Yeah, that's that was our weekend. We both got up early this morning, checked out of our hotel and went to work and we're going to spend tonight in East Chester at my mom's house. So. We're gonna try to save a little bit of money. The contractor did not come today since it is a holiday. He's coming tomorrow to paint. So I don't know how many days we have to stay at my mom's, but at least one, maybe longer, I'm not sure. Hopefully the next time I see you guys, our apartment is back together. But I'm just in the office as you guys can tell. I'm editing i have the door open because it's just such a nice day out and i just want to see the beautiful sunshine so that's where i'm gonna end off the vlog 
thank you guys for spending the weekend with us and I will see you in the next vlog. Bye.